In this section, I'm going to show you how to take a group that you just created and attach it or assign it to a user in your system. So here in the menu option called Setup, over here under Security, you know how to add a user and you know how to create a group. And perhaps you just created a group and now you want to assign it to one of your users. So in that case, what you would do is you would go to Users per Office Settings. When you click on that option, you'll be able to find all of the people that have access to your software. Go ahead and find that user. And in this case, I'm going to look for good old Mary Smith. And it opens up that person's profile and shows me which offices she has access to. In this case, she only has access to one office, Newport Beach. So I'm going to click on that. Now, here on the right-hand side, I'll finally see certain options that we have given to Mary Smith in terms of security. One of those options, of course, is right here in the group membership. So I had assigned Mary to administrators, but I want to edit that. I created a new group called Front Desk, and now I want to assign her to that group. So I'm going to click here on the group called Front Desk. I no longer want her to have rights to the group called Administrators. So now she only has rights to the group called Front Desk and whatever rights have been assigned to that group. You can multi-select and give a user rights to more than one group and she or he will have the cumulative rights assigned to all of the offices. In this case, I just want her to have the rights that have been assigned to front desk. So once I check that, all I need to do is click here and save. And that's how you assign a group to an existing user.